Hi everyone, this is Mohit and welcome back to Engineer Tech Up channel. So today I'm going to share with you Senicron interview question and answer for automation test engineer due to eight year of experience and this is the latest question guys. So first of all, uh, before sharing uh, for this question, so just I want to share with you like if you're attending the interview, what a skill set is required in the market right now, okay? If you are a manual tester, Definitely, you are not getting the much calls. The very less openings are there for manual, you know, testing profile. So I suggest you please start to learn automation. Okay, okay. So you can start to learn any programming language, but I always prepare for Code Java. Code Java is the backbone for another programming language as well, and most mostly eighty five percent. 85% calls are coming from Java Selenium, right? So this is the mandatory a skill to start your automation. You have to know Java Selenium. Then now in the market, you have to also learn API testing, not only for manual, you have to learn automation as well. You can keep note down what you have to learn and how to start the preparation. Many contents are there in the market. You can learn from Udemy, you can join the live classes also. We are also providing the training as well. If you are in the Facebook and definitely you are getting my post as well, right? So as your wish, so where you can comfortable, but you have to become the master of the skill. You have a knowledge like the experience. So what is the company expectation we have right now? So again, I'm re repeating you, I start to learn Java, then Selenium, then API testing, Postman, rest assured, Cucumber, then you have to knowledge of Git and Jenkins. These are the mandatory uh, skill to start, right? And you have a knowledge of manual testing concept and SQL that is mandatory, right? So if you don't have this uh, skill set, definitely you are not getting the more calls, okay? So please uh, start to do the preparation, okay? You could see what the question they are asking in the current market right now. And Sunnycrown is a service best company. If you will go in the product way, then definitely this, this question level is high. But yes, you will get some idea about of what type of the question the company is asking in the current market. Okay, so let me share with you. The first question is tell me about your roles and responsibility. So if you are <laughs> definitely if you are uh, following my video or if you are following my series, I have discussed many times what is what tell me about your roles and responsibility end of like in the video description you will get the link where you will get all the video whatever the answer you know you want right so i will uh keep that link inside the description of the video so you can just go and you can watch so i'm, I'm not going to discuss answer here guys so because i have already discussed almost answer the question are going to repeat and definitely this will helpful for you guys if you are stuck somewhere you can find the answer as well if you're not able to find the answer you can ping in the comment i will definitely make the video on that okay so tell me about your roles and responsibility see just i will give you some suggestion of roles and responsibility so if you are showing as experience as a automation profile if you are a manual tester then your roles and responsibility will change i already made the video i will share that link okay then next question is what is black box and black uh, sorry black box and white box testing so this is for your manual concept testing concept what is severity and priority can you give one example right so if you are a manual tester or if you are learning the testing you should know this type of the question okay another question is write a code to find the second largest number in array this is the repeated question guys so i will share the link where you will get important question and answer you can i already have a some playlist and this video i will also make on this soon okay then you will get that my video also but as of now you guys can get the google it and you can try to solve yourself if you're not able to then try to do the google okay but you will get the link don't worry write a code for multiple window handles so in the selenium have a concept called multiple window handles then they have asked to write the code okay Another question is, where do you have used the OOP concept, the Selenium? So I have already 
you know use i have already made the video on that as well so definitely you can i will share some playlist and definitely you will get all the answer over there first of all you have to learn what is the oop concept if you know the oop concept then when you are writing the selenium code then you can find yourself where you are using the oop concept what type of the uh, exceptions do you face in your current project might be i think uh, exceptions okay might be a spelling mistake i think so so they have asked what type of the exception you have faced in your current project right you have to when you are doing the practice right so we are getting a lot of the exception like i can give you one painful exception null pointer exception right so what you are doing the practice you having that list 10 exception in your mouth and you have to know how to solve you have to know how to solve this exception how to handle this exception okay so prepare at least 10 exception like we having the no such element exception many exception is the right illegal state or some a steel type of exception okay so whatever the exception you are getting or if you're not then you can google it you will get it but i have already discussed in my previous video I will share the I will share the link for the answer as well. Still, you are not satisfied, then you can Google it. You can find it the answer. Okay. Once again. Okay. So, what type of the HTTP HTTP method in API testing? So, I told you right. You have a knowledge of API testing, right? So, we have a code operation, right? So, we having the many methods inside this. Uh, uh, http like we have a get post right uh put right so these are the methods are there but you can explore another question is what is the query and path parameter so this is the rest assured or api testing and how to write in the rest assured and where we can use query parameter and path parameter in api testing okay Tenth question is what is the difference in put and post method? Okay, so what is the difference between the put and post method? Okay, so you can just start to learn your API testing, you will get it. Okay, so can you tell the basics command of Git? I already explained you right what the skill set is required. So you have to know basics command of the Git as well. Basics command means when uh, you are working on the Git, we having the many basics command on the Git like general command what we are using, right? So when you are doing any changes on the code, then you have to commit your code and you have to post the code, right? If you're getting some conflict, then you have to know how to resolve this conflict. So these are the questions they're going to ask in the interview, okay? I think next question they have already asked how to resolve conflict when you are working in your uh, a scripting part and you are using the git then definitely you are getting some conflict then you should know how to resolve this conflict okay i think this is the technical round and i can say this is the average level of the question if you are preparing well and you will get 100% uh, you know answer for this question okay so that's it in this video so i'll share something hope you many of the people are very new in my channel so one second so if you are new in the channel just you can go for youtube and you can search ingenious tech hub okay so this ingenious tech hub you can just go here this is my channel name and here i will tell you some important playlist where you will get some real time interview question and answer so if you will go in this playlist so in this playlist i have almost repeated question and here some of the video you will get answer as well but in this video just i'm going to share the uh, question so it will save your time okay if you will get the chance you can prepare the answer as well so here you can see we having the top level of the mnc company question and answer this is the one thing like second thing you guys like i have said if you are a manual tester then what is your roles and responsibility in your automation right so some of the question i have prepared for common interview question for real time interview question and answer what the challenges you have faced in your automation project or your current project if you are a manual tester you are doing manual and automation tasks what is your roles and responsibility how to handle how to handle 
you know project when you are getting the automation project then how to handle what level of the practice you have to do, you have to do so you will get in this all the video here guys okay so please subscribe my channel and press bell icon you get you will get new video notification if you have any query you can comment below and definitely i will reply back to you thank you so much for watching this video see you in the next video bye bye